accepting men of color into the Royal Air Force. A good friend of mine, Sidney Kennard, whose father was an Englishman and his mother was a West Indian lady, he had a pilot's license because they were wealthy and he'd got one in, in America. He actually applied, came to England in 1940 to join the Royal Air Force, a very handsome, light-skinned guy, and they turned him down. But when things got bad, of course, they can turn to the colonies. And I was one of the first four from Guyana to volunteer. When I was 18, I passed to go to America to work on the farm or in the factories. I also took the test for the Royal Air Force and I passed the test. And my mother said to me, my son, the mother country is at war. Go and help. If you live, it will be a good thing. So I came and served in the Royal Air Force because at that time, most West Indians thought it was a good thing. And I still think it was a good thing. The mother country was at war and she could not beat Nazi Germany in her own. It was about halfway through that I 